Are you tired of feeling stuck in a low energy state, unable to manifest the life you truly desire? The root of this problem often lies in our vibrational frequency, but don't worry, there's a solution. A surprisingly simple technique that can permanently elevate your conscious frequency. Stay tuned to discover this life-changing trick. Imagine a world where you're constantly in tune with the universe, attracting positive experiences and opportunities effortlessly. This isn't just a fantasy. It's the potential reality of living at a higher vibrational frequency. Everything in life is vibration, from our thoughts and beliefs to our emotions and energy field. Have you ever noticed how some people seem to radiate positivity, while others feel like they're constantly surrounded by a cloud of negativity? The difference often comes down to their vibrational state. By increasing your conscious frequency, you can transform your life from the inside out. Keep watching to uncover the surprisingly simple key to permanently elevating your vibration and unlocking the hidden power within you. And have you ever felt a subtle shift in your being, as if you're suddenly more attuned to the world around you? This sensation might be a sign that you're experiencing a change in your conscious frequency. But what exactly is this mysterious force that shapes our reality? Conscious frequency, also known as vibrational frequency, is the rate at which energy moves within and around us. It's not just a concept reserved for quantum physics. It's a fundamental aspect of our daily lives. Imagine your thoughts, emotions, and very essence as invisible waves constantly pulsing and interacting with the world. These waves create your unique energetic signature, influencing how you perceive and interact with the universe. But how can you tell if your frequency is rising? The signs might surprise you. Have you noticed a sudden aversion to alcohol, finding that even a small amount leaves you feeling off balance? Or perhaps your taste buds are rebelling against your usual comfort foods, instead craving fresh, vibrant meals. These unexpected changes could be indicators that your body is aligning with a higher frequency. As your vibrational state elevates, you might find yourself more in tune with the subtle energies around you. Your intuition may sharpen, guiding you with an uncanny accuracy. You might even notice a shift in your voice, a newfound confidence in your tone that reflects your inner growth. But what about those moments when you feel stuck in a low-frequency rut? We've all been there. Those days when negativity seems to cling to us like a heavy fog. In these low vibrational states, you might find yourself easily irritated, chronically exhausted, or caught in a cycle of drama and conflict. Your thoughts may feel sluggish, and the world around you might seem dull and uninspiring. Now imagine the opposite, a state of high vibration. In this elevated frequency, life takes on a different quality. Colors appear more vivid, your energy levels soar, and you radiate a magnetic charm that draws others to you. You might notice your skin clearing up, your posture improving, and a general sense of well-being permeating your days. But the effects of a high vibrational state go beyond the physical. Have you ever met someone who seemed to effortlessly attract positive experiences and supportive relationships? Chances are, they're operating at a high frequency. These individuals often possess a natural empathy, seeing beauty in the world around them and inspiring others with their positive outlook. The contrast between low and high vibrational states is stark, while low frequency living can leave you feeling trapped in a cycle of negativity. High frequency living opens doors to new possibilities. It's like upgrading from an old tube TV to a high definition flat screen. Suddenly, you're experiencing life with crystal clarity and vibrant detail. But here's the exciting part. Your vibrational state isn't fixed. Just as you can tune a radio to different frequencies, you have the power to adjust your own energetic vibration. The key lies in understanding the emotional frequency spectrum, a fascinating concept that maps our emotions to different vibrational levels. At the lower end of this spectrum, we find emotions like shame, guilt, and fear. These heavy feelings can weigh us down, keeping us stuck in patterns of low-frequency living. But as we move up the scale, we encounter emotions like joy, love, and peace, the high vibration states that can transform our experience of life. Intrigued? 
you should be. Because understanding and consciously shifting your emotional state is the first step towards permanently increasing your frequency. But there's more to this journey than just positive thinking. Keep watching to discover the unexpected techniques that can help you not only raise your vibration, but maintain it, creating lasting change in your life. Have you ever wondered why some emotions make you feel light and energized, while others leave you feeling heavy and drained? The answer lies in the fascinating world of emotional frequencies. Imagine your emotions as musical notes, each vibrating at its own unique pitch. This concept isn't just poetic. It's rooted in the groundbreaking work of Dr. David R. Hawkins, who introduced the emotional vibration chart in his book, Power vs. Force. Picture this chart as a spectrum of human emotions, ranging from the lowest, most dense vibrations to the highest, most ethereal ones. At the bottom, we find emotions like shame, guilt, and fear. The heavy notes that can weigh us down and keep us stuck in patterns of negativity. As we move up the scale, we encounter emotions like courage, acceptance, and reason, the middle notes that help us navigate life's challenges. And at the top, that's where we find the high notes of joy, love, and peace, the emotions that make us feel truly alive and connected to the universe. But why does this matter? Because your emotions aren't just fleeting experiences. They're powerful frequency modulators that directly influence your personal vibration. Think about it. Have you ever noticed how a moment of genuine gratitude can suddenly make everything in? Your life seem brighter? Or how a bout of anger can cloud your judgment and attract more negativity? This isn't coincidence. It's the law of vibration in action. Albert Einstein once said, everything in life is vibration. This applies to our thoughts, beliefs, and especially our emotions. Each feeling you experience sends out a specific frequency, like a radio signal broadcasting to the universe. And just like a radio, the universe tunes into and responds to the frequency you're emitting. Now you might be thinking, that's great, but I can't control my emotions. And you're right, to an extent. We can't always choose how we feel in the moment, but we can choose how we respond to those feelings. This is where the journey from lower to higher emotional states comes in. Imagine you're starting at the bottom of the emotional spectrum, feeling overwhelmed by shame or fear. The path upward doesn't require a giant leap. It's more like a gradual climb. You might first move into apathy, then to grief, and slowly work your way up through anger, desire, and pride. Each step, no matter how small, raises your vibration and opens up new possibilities. But here's the exciting part. As you move up the emotional frequency spectrum, you start to experience some truly remarkable changes. German researchers at the University of Kassel found that the heart of an average person emits 20 photons of light per second. But someone in a state of appreciation and loving kindness? They emit a staggering 100,000 photons per second. You're literally becoming brighter, more radiant, as you elevate your emotional state. And it doesn't stop there. Biophysicist Glenn Rain discovered that a state of heart coherence, achieved through positive emotions like gratitude, can actually repair and activate your DNA. You're not just feeling better, you're healing on a cellular level. So how can you start climbing this emotional ladder? It begins with awareness. Pay attention to how different emotions feel in your body. Notice the thoughts that accompany them. This mindfulness is the first step in consciously shifting your emotional state. But remember, this isn't about suppressing negative emotions or forcing yourself to feel happy all the time. Every emotion has its place and purpose. The goal is to understand the spectrum, recognize where you are on it, and gently guide yourself towards higher vibrations when you're ready. As you practice this awareness and intentional shifting, you'll likely notice something incredible your default emotional state will gradually rise. What once felt like a struggle to maintain positivity becomes your natural way of being. You're not just visiting the higher frequencies, you're moving in. Have you ever noticed how your thoughts seem to paint your world, coloring your experiences with vibrant hues or dull shades? This isn't just poetic imagery, 
It's a glimpse into the profound impact your thoughts have on your vibrational frequency. Imagine your mind as a powerful radio, transmitter, constantly broadcasting signals that shape your reality. But what exactly are these signals and how do they influence your energetic state? Let's explore the fascinating realm of thought frequencies. Your mind is a bustling hive of activity, generating an astounding 60,000 to 70,000 thoughts every single day. But here's the kicker. According to Dr. Joe Dispenza, a whopping 90% of those thoughts are repeats from the previous day. It's like your mind is stuck on a loop, playing the same old tunes over and over again. Now picture each of these thoughts as a tiny vibration rippling out into the universe. Positive thoughts create high-frequency waves, while negative ones emit lower, denser vibrations. It's not just New Age philosophy. It's rooted in the fundamental laws of physics. As Albert Einstein famously stated, everything in life is vibration. Your thoughts are no exception. But how does this constant mental chatter actually affect your overall frequency? Imagine you're having a day filled with worry and self-doubt. Each anxious thought sends out a low-frequency signal, gradually pulling your vibration down. It's like tuning your radio to a station full of static. Everything feels off, and you might find yourself attracting more negative experiences. On the flip side, what happens when you fill your mind with thoughts of gratitude, joy, and optimism? These high-frequency thoughts act like tuning forks, raising your overall vibration. Suddenly, you're broadcasting on a clearer channel, and the world around you seems to respond in kind. Have you ever noticed how a simple shift in perspective can turn your whole day around? That's the power of your thoughts at work. This phenomenon aligns perfectly with the concept of like attracts like, a cornerstone of the law of attraction. Your thoughts aren't just internal experiences, they're magnetic forces, drawing similar energies into your life. When you consistently think positive thoughts, you're essentially sending out an invitation for positive experiences to enter your life. But here's where it gets really interesting. Your thoughts don't just influence your immediate experiences, they have the power to shape your reality on a deeper level. Research has shown that positive thinking can actually alter your brain's neural pathways, creating new connections and strengthening existing ones. It's like your thoughts are literally rewiring your brain, paving the way for lasting changes in your vibrational state. So, how can you harness this incredible power of thought to permanently elevate your frequency? It starts with awareness. Pay attention to the constant stream of thoughts flowing through your mind. Are they mostly positive or negative? Do they uplift you or bring you down? This mindfulness is the first step in taking control of your mental frequency modulators. Next, consider implementing practices that foster positive thought patterns. Meditation, for instance, can help quiet the mind and create space for higher vibration thoughts to emerge. Positive affirmations, when used consistently, can rewire those neural pathways we talked about earlier, gradually shifting your default thought patterns to a higher frequency. Remember, though, that this isn't about suppressing negative thoughts or forcing yourself to be positive all the time. That approach often backfires, creating internal resistance and lowering your vibration. Instead, aim for a gentle, compassionate awareness of your thoughts. When you notice a low vibration thought, simply acknowledge it without judgment and then consciously choose to shift your focus to something more positive. As you practice this awareness and intentional thought shifting, you'll likely notice something remarkable your default vibrational state begins to rise. What once felt like an effort to maintain positive thoughts becomes your natural way of being. You're not just visiting higher frequencies, you're moving in permanently. Have you ever walked into a room and instantly felt your energy shift? It's as if the very air around you has its own unique vibration, influencing your state of being in subtle yet profound ways. This isn't just your imagination at work. It's a glimpse into the powerful relationship between your environment and your personal frequency. Imagine your surroundings as a vast ocean of energy, constantly ebbing and flowing around you. Just as a pebble creates ripples in a pond, every element in your environment, from the people you interact with to the spaces you inhabit, 
sends out waves that interact with your own energetic field. These interactions can either elevate your vibration or drag it down, often without you even realizing it. Let's explore the natural world first. Have you ever noticed how a simple walk in the woods can leave you feeling refreshed and revitalized? It's not just the fresh air and exercise. Nature itself has a profound impact on your vibrational frequency. Studies have shown that spending time in natural settings can lower blood pressure, reduce fatigue, and even decrease the likelihood of cardiovascular and respiratory disorders. It's as if Mother Nature herself is giving your frequency a gentle boost. But what about the human element? Think about the last time you were around someone who constantly complained or gossiped. How did you feel afterward? Chances are, your energy took a nosedive. On the flip side, being in the presence of positive, uplifting individuals can make you feel like you're walking on air. The emotional states of those around you act like tuning forks, resonating with and influencing your own vibrational frequency. Now let's turn our attention to your physical spaces. Have you ever walked into a cluttered, chaotic room and felt your stress levels instantly spike? Or stepped into a clean, organized space and felt a sense of calm wash over you? Your immediate environment plays a crucial role in maintaining your vibrational frequency. People with high vibrations often keep their homes clean and filled with items that promote positive energy, such as crystals, plants, and meaningful symbols. But here's where it gets really interesting. Your home isn't just a reflection of your current vibrational state. It's also a powerful tool for elevating it. Imagine your living space as a canvas where each object and arrangement is a brush stroke contributing to the overall energetic. Masterpiece. By consciously curating your environment, you can create a space that consistently uplifts and supports your highest vibration. So how can you harness the power of your environment to permanently increase your frequency. Start by bringing more nature into your daily life. This could be as simple as taking regular walks in a nearby park or adding more plants to your living space. Remember, even small doses of nature can have a significant impact on your vibrational energy. Next, take a look at the people you surround yourself with. Are they lifting you up or bringing you down? While it's not always possible to completely avoid negative individuals, you can limit your exposure to those who drain your energy and seek out relationships that nourish and inspire you. Finally, turn your attention to your physical spaces. Regularly cleansing, organizing, and decluttering your home can help maintain high vibrational levels. Consider incorporating elements that naturally elevate energy, like crystals or artwork that resonates with you. And don't forget about the invisible energies in your space. Arguments, stress, and illness can leave behind negative residues that lower the overall vibration of your environment. As you begin to consciously shape your surroundings, you may notice something remarkable. Your environment starts to work in harmony with your thoughts and emotions, creating a powerful synergy that elevates your frequency to new heights. It's like having a constant invisible support system, gently nudging you towards your highest potential. Have you ever felt like you're on the brink of a major breakthrough, but you're not quite sure how to make that final leap? We've explored how our thoughts and environment shape our vibrational frequency, but now it's time to dive into the practical techniques that can skyrocket your energy to new heights. Imagine having a toolbox filled with powerful methods to instantly elevate your frequency whenever you need it. Sound too good to be true? Keep watching because you're about to discover the game-changing practices that can permanently shift your energetic state. Let's start with a technique that's been praised for centuries, meditation. Have you ever noticed how a few minutes of quiet reflection can leave you feeling refreshed and centered? It's not just in your head. Meditation has been scientifically proven to calm your mind, reduce stress, and connect you with your inner self. But here's the kicker. It doesn't just make you feel good in the moment. Regular meditation practice can actually increase your overall energy levels, bringing more positivity and happiness into your life. Now imagine combining the mind-body benefits of breathing, meditation, and rhythmic movement into one powerful practice. That's exactly what yoga offers. It's like a triple threat for raising your vibration. 
Studies have shown that yoga can improve blood sugar levels, aid in the recovery of muscle and bone disorders, enhance cardiovascular health, and even reduce symptoms of anxiety and depression. It's like giving your entire being a frequency boost. But what if you're looking for something a little more mystical? Enter the world of energy clearing practices. Have you ever walked into a room and felt an immediate shift in the atmosphere? That's the power of energy at work. Techniques like smudging, sound baths, or even a simple space declutter can clear out negative energy and work wonders for your frequency. It's like hitting the reset button on your energetic field. Now here's a technique that might surprise you with its simplicity and effectiveness. Are you ready for it? Gratitude. That's right. Simply being thankful can be a game changer for your vibrational frequency. As one spiritual teacher put it, gratitude is like the express lane to high vibes. Kick off or wrap up your day by counting your blessings. It's a game changer, trust me. The more you engage with the frequency of gratitude, the more life seems to throw reasons to be grateful your way. It's like creating a feedback loop of positivity. But how long does it take to see results from these practices? While you might feel an immediate shift after a single meditation or yoga session, the real magic happens with consistency. Think of it like working out. You wouldn't expect to see major changes in your physical body after just one gym session, right? The same principle applies to your energetic body. Regular practice is key to permanently elevating your frequency. Imagine starting your day with a simple gratitude practice, followed by a short meditation. You then move your body with some yoga and perhaps end your evening by clearing your space energetically. Can you feel how this routine might start to shift your baseline frequency? It's like tuning your personal radio to a clearer, more positive station day by day. But here's something to keep in mind. These practices aren't about forcing yourself into a permanent state of bliss. Life will still have its ups and downs. The goal is to raise your overall vibrational set point so that even when challenges arise, you're better equipped to handle them from a higher energetic state. As you incorporate these techniques into your daily life, you might start to notice some surprising changes. Colors may appear more vivid, your intuition might sharpen, and you could find yourself naturally attracting more positive experiences and relationships. It's as if you're aligning yourself with the natural flow of the universe, becoming a magnet for higher vibrations. Have you ever experienced a moment when everything seemed to fall perfectly into place, as if the universe was conspiring in your favor? This isn't just a lucky coincidence, it's a glimpse into the powerful connection between your conscious frequency and the world around you. We've explored various techniques to boost your vibration, but now it's time to uncover how this elevated state can actually manifest your deepest desires. Imagine your heightened frequency as a magnet, constantly attracting experiences and opportunities that match your energetic signal. This isn't just a fanciful idea, it's the cornerstone of the law of attraction, a principle that has intrigued philosophers, spiritual teachers, and even quantum physicists for centuries. But how exactly does this invisible force work its magic? Picture your thoughts and emotions as radio waves, constantly broadcasting your internal state to the universe. When you operate at a higher frequency, you're essentially tuning into a clearer, more powerful channel. Suddenly, you might find yourself in the right place at the right time, meeting just the person you needed to connect with or stumbling upon the perfect opportunity. It's as if the universe is responding to your energetic signature, bringing you experiences that resonate with your newfound vibration. But here's where it gets really interesting. Your heightened frequency doesn't just attract external circumstances. It actually shapes your perception of reality. Have you ever noticed how a simple shift in mood can completely transform your day? When you're vibrating at a higher level, you're more likely to see opportunities where others see obstacles, to find solutions where others see problems. It's like putting on a pair of rose-tinted glasses, except these glasses reveal the true potential hidden within every situation. Now you might be wondering, how can I harness this power to manifest my deepest desires? This is where practices like visualization 
and affirmations come into play. Visualization isn't just daydreaming. It's a powerful tool for aligning your energy with your goals. When you vividly imagine your desired outcome, feeling the emotions associated with its achievement, you're actually raising your vibration to match that reality. It's like creating an energetic blueprint that the universe can then bring into physical form. Affirmations work in a similar way, reprogramming your subconscious mind to overcome self-doubt and align with higher vibrations. By consistently repeating positive statements about yourself and your life, you're essentially tuning your internal radio to a frequency of success and abundance. It might feel awkward at first, but remember, you're rewiring years of potentially negative self-talk. Give it time, and you'll likely start to notice subtle shifts in your thoughts, feelings, and even the opportunities that come your way. But here's a crucial point to remember. Manifestation isn't about forcing outcomes or controlling every aspect of your life. It's about aligning yourself with the natural flow of the universe, trusting in its wisdom while taking inspired action. Think of it as co-creating with the cosmos, rather than trying to bend reality to your will. As Mary Morrissey from the Brave Thinking Institute explains, if you want a different life, you have to change the frequency, similar to changing channels on a TV to watch a different movie. Your current life experiences are a perfect mirror to your thoughts, feelings, and emotions. This insight reveals the profound connection between your inner world and your external reality. By consciously elevating your frequency, you're essentially changing the channel of your life, tuning into a reality that aligns with your highest aspirations. Have you been eagerly awaiting the revelation of that one simple trick to permanently elevate your frequency? Well, the moment has finally arrived. Prepare to be surprised by its simplicity and power. The key to lasting elevation lies in a practice so fundamental you might overlook its transformative potential. Gratitude. Imagine starting each day by acknowledging the good in your life. How might this shift your perspective? Science suggests that gratitude isn't just a feel-good exercise, it's a frequency amplifier. Research has shown that practicing gratitude can significantly impact your overall well-being and vibrational state. But how do you harness this power effectively? Consider creating a gratitude journal where you list three things you're thankful for each day or try expressing appreciation to someone in your life. As you cultivate this practice, you may notice a subtle yet profound shift in your energy. Ready to embark on this transformative journey? Subscribe to delve deeper into the world of conscious living. May your path to higher vibrations be filled with joy and discovery.